It's been a long time. What's up, guys? Who's here? Let's see. X Men Hidden joined. Kudra, what's up? Melike, Ele, Shosho, what's up? Oh, we are, we are. <laughs> what's up, everybody? Hello. It has been a whole week. I didn't do a live for like a week. It's been so long, but you know, the holidays, we had Christmas. Actually, I, I did a live on Christmas. And then we had New Year's, and New Year's morning, I was tired, you know, so I couldn't do a live. But I'm here today, and I missed all of you beautiful people. What's going on? So how's everybody doing? How was your day today? Water, H2O, you got to drink it. So let's see, let's see what's going on. I love your new hair. Oh, thank you, Cabralon97. Thank you. In fact, for you guys, if you don't know, my husband and I did an amazing vlog. Okay, I want you guys to check that out. It's up on my YouTube. And you know, I worked in some English teaching, so there's a vlog and you're learning English and then you get to see my haircut transformation, you know? You like that profile? Yes, yes! <laughs> okay, I'm so excited to see you guys <clears throat> and talk to you all again. It's been a while. Let's see. Hello from Poland. Hello. How do you say he uh, hello in Polish? Hey, Veronica. I love your new hairstyle. Thank you, Sila. Thank you. So, you guys, this is so exciting for me. Let me calm down. Hold on. <sighs> Can't talk too fast. All right, but anyway, you guys, I am really working on my new YouTube channel. I am creating vlogs, my husband and I are creating these vlogs that are going to show you our daily life, things that we do, and you're also going to learn English, okay, at the same time. I also put in some Turkish subtitles because I have a lot of Turkish followers here on Instagram. So, let's see. I. Let's see, any comments that I'm missing here? I don't want to miss any questions. Let's see. Hello, Veronica, how are you? Hi, Bushra. I remember how to pronounce your name from the other time. I'm doing really good. I'm really happy to be back live and talk to all of you. Let's see. Dilara, hello. How are you, darling? Let's see, let's see. I don't want to miss any of your comments. Let's see. Sina says, I am studying English language teaching and you are my idol. Oh my God, you are so sweet. Well, you know, thank you. I'm glad that I'm your idol. <laughs> I never expected to be someone's idol, but you know, I just have fun. So that's a tip. If you're going to be an English teacher, just have fun with whatever you're doing, you know, and your students are going to love you. Hi, Erkan Amja. Nessasanis. Napiorsanis. Hello. Okay. So, you guys, how was your new year? I haven't talked to anybody since the new year. Merhaba, uh, Ridvan Amja. <laughs> the Amjas are here. They are here. <laughs> Let's see. Dilara says, I am tired. What about you, teacher? Ooh, no, I'm not tired, even though here in America, it is morning time, about 10 something. So where is everybody from? I know we have people from Poland. I know we have some, you know, my Turkish peeps, people, my Turkish peeps in the house. So where is everybody from? Put where you're from. I want to know. I want to know. All right. So anyway, I saw one question that said, 
Um, what is your son's name? My son's name is Dole Ryan. He has one name, Dole, but we also gave him an English name, Ryan, just because, you know, it's easier, you know, and Americans can't really pronounce. I mean, you can pronounce do if you try, but it's not very natural, that sound for us. So I gave him a second name, an English name, so that, you know, if he wants to use that one or that one, he's got choices, choices, choices. Let's see. Your Turkish is really good. Thank you. I'm working on it. I am working on my Turkish. I am starting to watch um, some more shows. What What was I watching? Yesterday, I was watching, um, it was old because I didn't catch it when it was new. Uh, Alish Virish, uh, Alish Virish Malekleri, is that what it is? You know, kind of like Ishte Binim Stilim. I used to watch that show all the time. When I lived in Turkey, I was always watching Ishte Binim Stilim. Does anybody, did anybody watch Ishte Binim Stilim? It was Butars Benim, then it turned into Ishte Binim Stilim, and now it's Elish Birish Angels. Okay, let's just, okay. <laughs> Who watched Ishte Binim Stilim? Let's see. It's Mujen. Can I ask you something? This is so important, Veronica. When we use I prefer, we should say stay at home or staying at home. When we use I prefer. Okay. When you say I prefer, you need to say to. I prefer to. You don't want to just say I prefer stay at home. I prefer to stay at home, not staying at home. You can say I am staying at home tonight. What are you doing, Mujin? I'm staying home tonight. Do you prefer to go out? No, I prefer to stay home. Got it? Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Did I answer your question? All right. Let's see. Veronica Turkçe kaçinci İngilizce de nasıl soruyorlar? Anlamadım, canım. I only understood a little bit of that. Listen, I, I'm not 100% fluent in my Turkish yet. Not yet, not yet. So, um, let me... Türkçe kaçınca İngilizce de nasıl soru? If somebody can translate that for me, because I kind of have an idea what it means, but I'm not sure. I'll try and answer your question. Let's see... Poland Pila. I am an Erasmus student in here. Oh, you're an Erasmus student in Poland. Awesome. Just check in the comments, you know. I don't want to miss you guys. I don't want to miss your guys' comments. You know, I love you all. How can I improve my English? AJ, am I saying that right? AJ, yeah. Yeah. Um, how can you improve your English? Well, one of the first things that you need to decide is why are you learning English, okay? What is the reason? Uh, is it for business? Are you going to work in a company where you need to speak English? Are you learning English just because you want to make some foreign friends and you want to travel? You need to think of your reasons why. And then focus. So, for example, if I'm learning English because, let's say, ooh, that doesn't look cute. Sorry. Um, if you are learning English because, um, for academic reasons, right? You're in university, you're in college, and you need to um, learn English so you can, you know, whatever. Then you want to focus on really getting your grammar good. You know, um, if it's business English, you got to learn all of the terminology, vocabulary that um, people use in the business world. You know, uh, formal English is very popular for business English. Um, if it's just casual speaking, like you want to travel, you want to make some friends, you know, you want to do your thing in English, you want to do your thing in English. 
then I would say really um, watching TV, watching me, watching me, watching TV and watching me, um, and, you know, getting into British and American culture, learning how we speak in everyday life. In fact, that's what I was saying about uh, my vlogs that I'm starting on YouTube. The vlogs are going to be my everyday life. Sometimes really fun stuff, sometimes just normal life. But in those vlogs, I'm going to be speaking and I'm going to teach you all the vocabulary that I'm saying in my everyday life. Just some things are simple, some things are more difficult, complex vocabulary, but you're going to learn what Americans, me, an American, is um, <laughs> saying just in my everyday life. So. Um, that's a great way. You have to get into English every day. Okay? That doesn't mean you have to spend hours of your time studying English. It means do something every day. 10 minutes, an hour, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 15 minutes, 5 minutes, whatever you want. Um, but do something every day that gets you closer to your goal. Like I've said many times before, what you want to do is you really want to get your hobbies and your interests into English. Um, wow, I'm missing a lot of comments. Um, you want, if you, like I've said before, if you like to dance, then learn to talk about dance in English. Learn to talk about yourself in English. What, what do you like? What you don't like? What are your hobbies? What are your interests? What's your favorite movie? What's your favorite food? Learn how to talk about yourself and, you know, it's going to come. It takes time, but, you know, that's a more fun approach to learning English, I think. Okay, so let me see. Ozge says, OMG, you watch Ishte Binim Stilin. You are so cute. I watch also. I like you. Yes, I, you know what? Ishte Binim Stilin was so funny. Sometimes their outfits, their clothes. Honey, no. You're not going to win. You're not going to win. Not tonight. Not tonight. Not with that outfit, honey. <laughs> Let's see. Show Show says, yes, I watched it. Lots of critics and fights. I know. The fights are so funny. Girls, girls can be really mean to each other. How do you say mean in Turkish? Like mean. Not nice. Oh, that show, if I was on that show, I would be stressed out. People would try and fight me because I wouldn't let anybody talk mess to me. Do you know what talk mess? It's actually the other word, a bad word. I'm not going to use it here, but it means like, you know, talking crazy. Let's see. Him Shirem 32 says, I don't like programs like that. Yeah, I know. It's, you know... But it's entertaining. What can I say? I also watch, I also watch Evelyn Jackson Gell, okay? Evelyn Jackson Gell. Yeah. I watch all those kind of shows. Let's see. Can you suggest any CELTA certificate program in any university in America? Well, you know what? I didn't take the CELTA. I did the TESOL. So I don't, I can't really tell you about the CELTA program. But I do know that in Turkey, they do have a really good CELTA program, and I believe it is at the Cambridge Center. So you might want to check that out if you're in Turkey. Let's see. I am wondering what is meaning meh? Meh? Do you mean like if somebody is like meh, meh? It's kind of like, it's just a sound. It doesn't mean anything. It's kind of like, meh, you know, whatever. Eh, I don't really like it. Meh. <laughs> it's just a sound, you know. Let's see. Where, what are you from? You mean, where am I from? From, Rabba? I am from America, Michigan. I currently live. I reside. There's another vocabulary word. Write it down. Write it down. I live. I reside in California, Los Angeles. 
Let's see. Ugir Salam 34 says, your child's so sweet. Thank you. He is a handful. Okay? Handful. Do you know what that means? It means like, he's, my son is chok hejanle. Tons of energy, moving around, and you have to, he's a handful. It's, you know, you have to watch him. So, yes, but he is, he's a sweet boy. Let's see. Uh, I don't understand your question, Attila Anuman. You can say first or second. Just the question is how, I don't understand, sweetheart, sorry. Dilara says, I learn English because I want to be cabin crew job. Oh, so you want to work on the airplane. We say airplane stewardess. You know, or you want to do that? That's awesome. A lot of traveling. You do need to know some English for that. So good luck to you. Jasmine Shai. Hi, read my comment, please. Are your teeth natural? Yes. I had some less that. Yes, they're natural. They're natural. They're natural. I wish. I wish. I wish I could get some fake teeth because I'd take them out. About to go to sleep. Take out my teeth. What do you say in Turkish? Dish chikijam. Put it in the cup, you know. You take your teeth out at night. Put them in the cup. Good night. <laughs> no, my teeth are natural. Yes, darling. Okay. Hunar Solomon says, we need to learn English for our jobs. It's necessary. It's necessary, not it's a necessary. Yeah, it is, uh, because um, English is the language of business nowadays, that and Chinese. You guys might need to learn Chinese pretty soon, so I won't be able to help you there. I know Shay Shay. Shay Shay, that means thank you in Chinese. Let's see. I love watching you. Thank you, Delara. I love seeing you give me nice comments. That's so sweet. Again, let's see the same question. How can I improve my speaking in English? Oh, speaking. Okay, so here's a tip. To improve your speaking, you have to speak. That means if you don't have anyone to talk to, you have to talk to yourself. Okay? So if you don't have friends or people that you can practice speaking English with, you need to speak to yourself. Um, what you need to do is go on the internet, get conversation questions, okay? You can find them anywhere. Just Google ESL or English conversation questions. And then what you want to do is practice asking those questions and then answering those questions in different ways. Natural response answers, you know. So you need to speak and you need to, if you have no one to speak to, you have to speak to yourself. A lot of people, a lot of my students say, I can't practice speaking because I have no one to speak to. <laughs> well, you still can speak to yourself. Listen to yourself speak. Record it when you, you know, you have to speak to yourself. Let's see. Marve says, I speak very fast. Sorry. Look, lipstick. I hate that. He want to learn it. He said, how can I ask firstly, secondly in English? How can you ask firstly? How do you use that? Like, um, well, um, if you're making a point, right? If I'm saying why I like to go to the beach. Firstly, I love to swim in the water. Secondly, I love to lay out in the sun. Thirdly, I get to wear a bathing suit. Is that good enough? I don't know. So yes, yes, yes, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so you know what? I'm going to let the comments go for a minute because... Uh, Yes, my teeth are natural, Jasmine. What, what is the deal? It's n very natural. Very natural. Oskay says you're the best teacher. Oh, you're so sweet. You're so sweet. 
Mean girl, kutsu kiss. See, I'm like, my comments don't move fast enough. Do you recommend some language schools over there? For example, California State University, oh, CSU. You know, honestly, I don't work at any of the universities. I work online, so I don't work at any language schools here. I can't really uh, recommend a place. I'm sure that CSU has an amazing language course or school because it's CSU. It's amazing. So yeah, I mean, if you are going to go into California for language and they have a program at CSU, take it. I see a woman who is full of energy and shining. Love you from Instamail. Oh, thank you, Boo You're so sweet. Uh... Hi, Richmond Famous. How are you, darling? How are you? I like the saying, yas. Yas. I like it too. You guys, the comments are like, okay, there we go. Here, here's one. I am working as an engineer and I have to participate in some international meetings, but I don't understand what they are talking about. So I think my listening is very bad. So what do you recommend? Okay, Hussein, um, for listening, <laughs> this is going to sound really like stupid, but you have to listen. <laughs> okay, get some movies, uh, get a series. You know what's a really good English series that's really funny? The Office. The Office, okay? Listen to TED Talks. You just have to listen to English on a daily basis. You have to listen to it over and over again, and you need to speak. A lot of people say that I speak very fast and I try to slow it down, but to understand when someone is speaking at a natural pace or even fast, you should try speaking English fast. It sounds strange, right? But if you are having a hard time understanding English because people are speaking really fast, when you practice speaking, Speak fast, you know, and then you will start to, you will understand the words because you're doing it. You're speaking fast. So when you hear it, you know, you're like training your ear, you're training your brain, right? So you could practicing, hi, my name is Hussein. I'm, da -da -da. I'm 24 years old. I'm from Turkey, blah, blah, blah, blah, blah, blah, blah, blah. I live in a house. I live in an apartment. You know, just speak faster, listen and speak faster. And that actually really does help training your ear, speaking faster. So practice that. And also, you know, basic terminology in business, you know, look up online business English, uh, commonly used vocabulary, um, and practice that. The only way you can train your ear is by listening. And I really think speaking fast, quickly, also really helps too. Okay. Let's see. Attila, Veronica, I did not get my answer. My English is not well. Yes, I love Black Mirror too. That's an awesome show. Okay, well, Attila, um, I'm getting a lot of comments here. It's really hard to see every single one. So maybe write your question more clearly again so I can answer it. Hello, John Burka, Bur Burka, no, not Burka. <laughs> John Burke Chamur. Friends series. Definitely guys should watch. Friends. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. Just wonder how I can ask for my sport team level. What do you want to ask? What is my favorite Turkish food? My favorite Turkish food is dolma. Any dolma. Lahana. Um, uh, Yeshil biber dolma. I don't know all the special words, but dolma, yogurt with saramsak. Okay, there you go. Let's see. Ozge, Veronica, please help me. I can speak English, but nearly always don't understand. For example, when some person asks me something, I can't understand, but I can speak. I know it's funny, but problem for me. Yeah, you have to work on your listening. 
and you have to practice speaking. Like I say, go get the conversation questions on online, write English conversation questions. Practice asking those questions to yourself and answering them in different ways. You have to speak. You have to get used to hearing your voice in English, okay, and listening and listening and listening. That's why I say do something every day. If you really want to improve your English, do something every single day, one hour, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Because the more you do, the faster you're going to improve. It has to become a part of your daily life, okay? A lot of people, they go to English lessons twice a week. They learn a little bit, and that's it. That's it. They still need a lot of work because they don't do it every day. So it's not just two days a week for three hours or two hours. Every day. That's why I say Find English TV that you like. I like The Office is a really good show. Uh, Black Mirror, somebody said, Friends. You know, because then you're listening to English and you're relaxing. You're listening and you're relaxing. So it's not like you're working so much. Let's see, Yura, guess how many months after I can improve my English? For advanced level, if you're advanced, um, you should be able to improve your English very quickly, um, especially if you're advanced. So I would say if you do something every day, if you're listening to English music, watching English TV, if you're speaking every day, even to yourself, I mean, it's really up to you when you improve. Hi, Veronica. I am a teacher of English and love you as a good model. Oh, thank you. Okay, so a lot of people are asking me the same question. I've answered it. You just have to speak, you know, and get some conversation questions. Yes, I miss you, Shosho. I miss you. I, I've seen your, um, your Instagram. You are singing, looking amazing. I love it. When will you come to Turkey? I will be coming to Turkey, I believe, in August. In August, August. Um, I think in Turkish you say Agostos, Agostos, is that how you say it? So yes, I'll be coming to Turkey in August, and I'm going to be like, Merhaba, Nesesiniz, Napiyorsunuz, what's going on, Merhaba, Nesesiniz, Napiyorsunuz, what's going on? That's what I'm going to be like. Thank you, Darya. Darya. Okay. Tuba, I believe, says, which course do you recommend for learn quickly, personnel or group? Personal or group? Do you mean like private lessons or group lessons? I think um, group lessons are really good um, if you're trying to learn English because you have people that you can speak with in the class. You have friends. Um, you have the teacher. Um, and you have people at different levels in the classroom. So you might have somebody who is advanced. You might have somebody who's middle, you know. So that's good. I suggest private lessons if you need to hurry up really fast. If you're taking TOEFL or if you're taking IELTS, you know, then take private lessons. Aw, no need to go to an English lesson. Join here and learn English easier than others. Thank you. And again, you guys, my please go to my YouTube channel. It's linked at um, on my Instagram. There's a link there for it. Go on there. I have vlogs. I have two new vlogs up that help you learn English, and we're having fun. So please subscribe and like my videos because I want to keep them coming, you know. Tell me, you guys, what... Um, would you like to see in my vlogs? You know, you guys are the ones who are watching me. What do you want me to do? What would you like to see me do? Okay, now Attila says, okay, let me try. Attila says, okay, let me try. Imagine you have three toys and you like them in any level. First, A. Second, B. Third, C. So how can I ask which one is the right? In Turkish, we have question as kajinji, kachinji. Oh, 
Kach and Je. Kach. I know Kach is like how many, right? So um, if you're asking like on a scale to 1 to 10, how much do you like this toy? First, I like this toy. The second toy, I like the third toy. I mean, this is kind of a hard question for me to answer because I'm really not understanding it. So, Attila, please don't be upset. What I'm going to do, because my what you can do is actually, if you write it to me and send it to me in a message, write in Turkish, and I'll have my husband read it to me and I'll answer your question, okay? Because I really want to answer it. I'm just having a hard time kind of understanding what you're saying, okay? Uh, you and your husband in London? Oh, no, I'm not in London. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. That's country music. Have you ever heard American country music? <laughs> it's so funny. American country music is like... And down when I love America, cause it's the like the voices like that. And I love you. <laughs> I don't really listen to country music, but my grandma does. I am not in Turkey right now. No. No, no, no, no, no. I have a good teacher. Thanks, everything. Oh, great. Okay, you guys, so look, I've been answering a lot of questions. I actually wanted to ask you guys some questions that I saved on my handy-dandy telephone. So let me just go to my screenshot. And, you know, I have some questions for you guys. You know, I have some things that I want to ask you because it's been on my mind. Okay, let's start. Okay, what is something that you have never done. Conversation questions, guys. <laughs> Practice your English right now, right now. What is something you have never done? You have never done. Okay, that's a, that's a really big question. You can say a lot of stuff there. For me, I have never, I have never gone skydiving. Skydiving. Do you guys know what skydiving is? Skydiving is when you get in an airplane and you jump out. You get in an airplane and you jump out. No, no, no, no, no, no, no, I'm not doing that. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing that. I'm not getting in an airplane and jumping out. <laughs> Can you see me? Okay. All right, I think this is a good place for me to jump. You know, I might, I might live this, the parachute, you know, like when they jump out of the plane, but it's called a parachute, it comes out and you're floating down. They're like, ah, no, no, I'm not getting in a plane and jumping out. Sorry. It says most people in America don't, doesn't, don't, doesn't like country, why? No, actually, a lot of people in America like country music. I actually don't mind it. I liked Taylor Swift when she was doing more country music, but it's the voice. It's the voice. The voice is just too much. In the mountains, I'm drinking on beer, and I'm hanging with my friends tonight. I don't like that. Sorry. You know who I like right now? I like um, Kendrick Lamar. I like um, SZA, S-Z-A. She's a really good, really good one. All right. Let's see, you guys. <laughs> My voice is famous. Was that good? Why you want to do me like that? No, it's not. It's not. I think Attila wants to learn how to ask what grade are you in. Okay, well, he's going to write me and I'm going to answer that question for him. So, okay, let's see. I have never smoked. Good for you, girl. Good for you, Bursha. Don't smoke cigarettes. Uh, what do they say? Cigarettes kill. But there was something else. 
Just don't smoke. It's bad. What else? I have never, I have never done climbing, high, mountain climbing. I have never done mountain climbing, BRC. <laughs> BRC, that's your name. I'm sorry, it's BRC. I have never done mountain climbing. And guess what? I will never do mountain climbing, okay? What, what do I look like? Like hanging off a mountain? This is great. I love mountain climbing. I'm climbing all the way to the top. And if I fall, it's okay, because I'm living the high life, right? No. No. I have never done bungee jumping, and I won't either. Yeah, tie a string, tie a rope to my feet, and throw me off a bridge. Really? Gear check time? Really? No, no genom. Not happening. No genom. Olmaz. Right? Is that how you say it? I have never, I have never, why, okay, I have never, you have never gotten to a train, you never been inside a train, okay, you need to take a train ride, choo choo, chugga chugga chugga chugga choo choo, riding on a train, riding on a train, you need to ride a train, you need to ride a train, so, okay, you guys, I don't see a lot of I have never. So what is something that you really want to do? What is something that you really want to do? I'm just looking at the comments waiting. I'm like, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Show, show. Like, oh, you um, sent a request. Her stuff will pop up, up like a story or something, and she's singing, What's and it's a lot of here? fun. So, <clears throat> okay, let me see. If I you guys like to sing or you want to learn how to speak, if the like English or sing bad, English songs, show, show. you should if check like, out some of her not, stuff. The connection because, you know, if it's blurry or something, then you'll have somebody to okay. watch. Let me see. Yes. Somebody <laughs> join our live. So, you guys, let's talk. i got to put my earpiece in because I can't hear Astrology. Let's see. Somebody says, actually, you can this live performance every week. Yes, I'm going. I do lives every Monday. Last week, I didn't do a live because it was <clears throat> New Year's and, you know, I was tired. I needed to sleep. So I couldn't do a live. But yes, every Monday for sure I'm doing lives. And like I said, oh, I'm a Gemini too. I'm a Gemini too. Hello, hello. Ikis Lodge. Um, <clears throat> Just tell me what it is in Turkish, or someone else can translate it. Your your uh, pox. Anyway, yes, I'm doing lives every Monday at this time, and I've started doing vlogs on YouTube. So please check out my YouTube channel. It's on my Instagram. There's a link. <clears throat> I also um, some of you may have seen some of my videos. So subscribe and like, please. That would be awesome. You're a Gemini too, show, show, show it. Awesome, so am I. See, <clears throat> that's why I like you. That's why I like you. Who else, what else is your horoscope? We have, so, I don't know all the names in Turkish, but I know that Cancer is Yengeç, I think. We have a lot of Geminis here. My birthday is May 29th. May is year mi 1986. I used to know my numbers in Turkish really good. Let's see. Uh, bin dokuz yüz seksen alta. Did I say it right? Yes. We have a Capricorn. Yeah, Capricorn. I was born in Michigan, Irem. Yeah, so there's Yengech is Cancer, Ikislar is Gemini, and that's all I know. <laughs> that's all I know. June 3rd. Hello, Jaylon. I love that name, Jaylon. When I was pregnant with my son, I was thinking he was going to be a girl. I don't know why. And I was like, I'm going to name him Jaylon, or I'm sorry, I'm going to name her if it was a girl. Jaylon or um, John Sue. I love that name. John Sue. John Sue. It's really pretty, but my husband didn't like it. So let's see. Are you from USA? Yes, I'm from the US. I am from the US. I was going to try and show you guys a picture of me when I was pregnant with my son and I had a really big belly. I had a really big belly. Let's see. I think you already forgot what you asked. Did I? <laughs> 
See, that's, you know, I'm a real person. I'm not perfect. Oh, no, I did ask something. I said, what horoscope are you? But I'm not seeing a lot of, um, I'm not seeing a lot of uh, answers. I saw Cancer. I saw Gemini. No, I saw Capricorn. I saw Gemini. So let me see. What did you ask me, darling? I'm sorry if I missed your question. I start talking. I start talking, and honey, I just keep going. I'm like, blah, blah, blah, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's see. Let's see. All right, so yeah, um, write your questions. I'll look. How are you? I am great. How are you? Aquarius, Kova, teach me some Turkish, please, because I need to start speaking better. Hello, Veronica. Where were you since now? I have been, um, I live in California. Before that, I was asleep because it's 10 o'clock in the morning. So yeah, hope that answers your question. Richmond Famous says, my birthday is on April 23rd. Third, honey, not 23rd. Not 25th. It's 23rd. But I still love you. That's okay. Let's see. Veronica, I am your 60... See, there's another problem. I'm glad I'm your teacher, honey. You're my 62nd subscriber on YouTube. So please don't forget me when you become a famous YouTuber. Oh, I will not forget you. You're so sweet. I hope that would be awesome, right? But you know, I'm not doing it to become famous, you know, even though I'd like to see my name in lights. Veronica Karadaman in the building, you know, they're like, Veronica, Veronica. I'm like, hi. No. <laughs> um, but yeah, I would like uh, my YouTube channel to reach more people because I think that this is a great way to learn English. You are speaking very fast. I'm sorry. I will speak slower for you. I will speak slower for you. You are the love of my life and I just want to treat you right. So I will speak slower for you, baby. I'm going to speak slower till the day I die. Okay, Merve, because I love you. Uh, let's see. Would you look at the message, please? Okay, okay, okay, okay, okay. What's the message? What's the message? What is the message? I don't see the message. Veronica, dark fume. What does that mean? You you are know me? No, I don't. Um, I think I, ch I talked to you on Instagram, but I was just singing to you because I wanted to. I wanted to sing to you. Okay. Let's see. I just got a text. Probably it's a student saying, Veronica, I'm going to be late. I'm going to be late. Let's see. Is it? Mm-hmm. Just what I thought. I'm going to be late to our lesson today. Really? Okay. All right. Let's see. Dark fume. Dar is it dark fume? Means kara duman. Oh yes. It, um. It isn't it dark. Um. Dark smoke or dark, dark uh, cloud or something like that. Yes, I remember you, darling. We love you so much. Oh, I love you too. I love you too. But I'm really trying to, um, I wanted to, before I go, because this is getting kind of long, um, I wanted to show you guys a picture, a picture. I wanted to share some of my, my life. I want to share my life with you. I want to share, I want to share, I want to share my love too. I wanted to try and find some pictures, but let's see. I don't want to miss the comments because you guys get mad at me when I don't see your comment. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't see any comments right now. All right. All right. All right. It's going to be all right. If you try and you try and you try. Oh, here, here's a wedding picture of me and my husband. Me and my husband. Can you guys see it? 
Oh, you can't really see it. Oh, wait. There. Can you see it? I have to turn it from the light. That's when I got married. Ah, yes, I got married, you guys. That's a picture from when I got married. Will you come to Turkey? Yes, I'm going to be coming to Turkey in August. It's a long time away, but I want to do a meetup or something. Would you guys like that? Can you say Merve? Merve, Merve, Merve, she is the one. Merve, she is the one you want to know. Merve, she's the girl, she's the girl, she's the g g girl, she's the girl, she's the girl, she's the girl, she's the Yes. Let's see. Can I share some more pictures with you guys before I go? I got a couple minutes. I got a couple minutes. I got a couple more minutes to stay with you, but I'll be back next week. I'll be back next week. Okay. I'm trying to find a picture. Oh, here's a picture of me and my dad. My daddy. That's my bubba. Dad, that's my dad. He'd be like, girl, don't show any pictures of me. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I don't know if it's going to take too long for me to, um, let me see. I want to go abroad to study. What do you recommend for me? I want to come. Can you help me? Um, I suggest that you look at online because honestly, I don't work at language schools here. I work through my website online and I, did I lose weight? I lost weight. Did I? Ooh, did I? I'm not trying to, but you know, it's better than saying you gained weight, right? <laughs> it's better than saying, Ooh, Veronica, did you gain weight? Your, um, your arms look kind of big. No, I did. I don't know. Did I lose weight? Maybe it's this, um, this, you know, contour I did. I did a contour. So maybe you think I'm looking slim, but actually it's the contour. It's the makeup, you know? Yeah. <laughs> what did you eat for breakfast? You are so energetic. I had coffee. I had coffee. Uh, uh, uh. I had coffee. Uh, uh, uh, I had bread, I had egg mac, I had a yamurtha, I had eggs, I had coffee and bread and eggs this morning for my breakfast, kavate yaptam. Let's see, what is your job? I am an English teacher. I'm a mother first. I am a wife. Well, wife or mother first, which one? I don't know. But I'm an English teacher. Can you see me? I see your picture, but um, actually you guys, this live is going to have to end in the next couple minutes. I couldn't find my picture. It's like at the bottom. So I'll have to share it with you guys next time. Um, but before I go, you guys write me some questions because, um, <clears throat> because I want to answer some quick questions before I end my live. If you have anything you want to ask me, I have about four minutes left. Hello, Seda. Seda. You say Murve, but it's Merve. Merve. Is that how you say it? Merve. Okay. Where do you live now? I live in California. Los Angeles. 90210. No, not 90210. I don't live in Beverly Hills. I don't have that much money yet. Sorry, guys. Okay, so look. Let me see my last little questions, and I'm going to end it. Biraz Türkçe biliyorum. Biraz anlıyorum. Biraz anlıyorum. Türkçe, Türkçe konuşuyorum. Okay, that song didn't work out. Sorry. That song didn't work out. I tried to do a song, and it didn't work. You know, that's awkward. Awkward moments in life. You try and do something funny and cute, but it doesn't work, and you're just like, so yeah. All right, you guys, look, I got to go. I'm so happy I was able to see all of you guys um, again because it's been a long time. Again, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like my videos if you like them. Um, I'm going to be making a lot more English-speaking vlogs, okay? So basically, it's me and my family and our daily life 
doing things and you're going to learn English vocabulary at the same time, like immersion, immersive learning, okay, like you're here, all right, so you can check out the link. Um, at the top of my Instagram page. Go there. The video is up already. It's up and popping. It's like, yo, go watch it, okay? I love you guys. I hope you're having an awesome, awesome day, night, evening, whatever. Okay, and I'll see you guys again soon. I'm going to try and do another live if I can in the week, but definitely Monday, okay? So like and subscribe. I'm sharing this video for 24 hours, okay? So I got to go. I love you guys. Bye-bye.